And this morning, authorities from both Laredo's held a press conference to inform the public about the benefits of having a radio frequency identification since renovations for the America's International Bridge will start tomorrow. Jasmina Trevino has more. The Department of Homeland Security recommend the use of the ready lane. This will reduce the waiting time and help speed up the process. As soon as uh, he finishes with the customer in front, uh, that he's uh, attending, the passenger arri arrives to the lane and he already has the information of that particular person on the screen. Ready lane is an assigned lane for travelers used at different port of entries in which ID cards that contains a radio frequency identification chip can be used. Because we see here on any given day it can be anywhere between eight to 11,000 vehicles. It's going to save, it's saving approximately about 20 percent of time when you add all those 20 seconds for all the vehicles you're talking about hours that are that are saved overall. This project is expected to start tomorrow at 10 p.m., meaning all traffic will be rerouted to Bridge Number 2 and Bridge Columbia. Bridge Number 1 will only be open for pedestrians and cyclists. As part of this project, authorities from Nuevo Laredo and Laredo are working together to inform the public about the closure of the bridge. We will be adding the infrastructure in the Colosio Boulevard and routes accessible to Bridge Number 2 posting announcements informing travelers that ready lanes are available. This renovation will take around 18 months, and the city officials are asking travelers to be patient, as this improvement will make pedestrians and vehicle traffic faster, safer, and more efficient. We ask uh, that if you're patient, within 18 months you'll have a more, uh, more efficient, more uh, revived uh, uh, bridge system and uh, for the convenience of everyone. In addition to this renovation, more security cameras will be added. This will help monitor travelers and U.S. Customs agents. For Fox 39, I'm Jasmina Treviño. Thank you, Jasmina, for this information.